Hello friends, welcome to Technocrat CS Academy. In this video, we are going to learn what is batch operating system. So let's start. So what is batch operating system? Batch operating system is one of the type of operating system. Now there are various types of operating system. Batch operating system is also one of the type of operating system. Before understanding what is batch operating system, let first understand what is mean by batch. So batch is a set of job with same types of requirement group together called batch. Now batch is nothing but set of job. Now what is mean by job? Job is a unit of work which contain program, data and instructions. So job is nothing but unit of work which contain program that is application program, data that is input data and instructions which control the application program. So job is nothing but unit of work which contain program, data and instructions. Now batch is a set of jobs with same type of requirements or same type of needs grouped together called as batch. For example student batch which having same kind of needs or requirement of subject like electronic student batch or computer student batch. Now let understand how batch operating system work. Now batch operating system is not interact directly to computer. That means batch operating system not communicate directly to CPU. Batch operating system carry operator which select similar kind of job and form group into batches for further processing. That means batch operating system not communicate directly to computer. So batch operating system carry operator. Operator or it is also called processor. Now what is the role of operator? Now operator can select similar kind of job or which having same kind of needs or requirement of job and forms groups into batches for further processing. That's why it is called as batch operating system. Now let understand this concept with diagram. Now here in this diagram there are four users and these four users having respective four job like job 1, job 2, job 3 and job 4. Now all these job 4 are submitted to operator. Then operator for makes a batches according to common needs of job. Now let consider one example weekly payroll system. Now the operator make two batches that is batch 1 and batch 2. Now batch 1 include job 1 and job 2 which perform common tasks of payroll cost management and batch 2 include job 3 and job 4 which perform common tasks of employee file updation. That means the responsibility of operator to sort a job with similar kind of needs. That is this operator makes the batches with same requirement and submitted one by one to the CPU or to computer. So this is all about batch operating system. Thank you. In next video we will going to learn about what is multi programming and multitasking.